Hello everyone, I'm your paleontologist for today and today I want you to show five, five fossils found here in our country. Do you know what is rhinoceros? Rhinoceros is a majestic creature that lives mostly in the savanna. But in 2014, rhinoceros fossils were accidentally found while excavating. <clears throat> it turns out that this fossil this fossil is 709,000 years old and they believe that this rhino butchered because they found some scratches in the fossils. Now, this, now a discovery has been discovered because that there are no people here in our country 709,000 years ago. Next is Megalodon. Megalodon shark tooth was fossils that has been discovered in Maribohok, Bohol. In the second time in discovery was made in the town of the island province of Bohol in central Visayas. It measured, it measured 105 millimeters long and 65 millimeters wide. And was has been half buried in the soil the megalodon is considered to be the largest giant predator shark that lives in the world, world's ocean about 200 million years ago. So far in the Philippines, only the teeth are found like other sharks. Most of their skeleton except of their teeth is made of not bone but cool cartilage which are doesn't preserve well in the fossil record. Consequently, their bodies never become fossil and almost all things we know about animals are based on their teeth. We are now in our third fossil, which is mammoth and stegodon fossil. Mammoth and stegodon are a related member of our modern elephants because they are member of the same family which is elephant today. Mammoths have a thick hair to protect them from cold. And the other one is Stegodon. Stegodon has an incredibly, incredibly long tusk and large trunk. They are both herbivores and they lived 200 years ago and become extinct 10,000 years ago because of hunting. Our fourth fossil is an ammonite. Ammonite is, an over, is a very common fossil because it spread all over the world. It is a marine mollusk animal that lives in the ocean. Ammonite lived during the Jurassic and Cretaceous together. This represents the time of interval of about 140 million years. They eat smaller species of animals and use their tentacles to catch their prey. And the last fossils is the sea cow. On the island of Palawan, born of an extinct sea cow that lives about 20 million years ago have been discovered in a cave. Several real and spine parts of aquatic animal, mammal, were found in limestone rock above the water of the underground river. On the island of Palawan, sea cows are fully aquatic animals. They are vegetarians. They eat sea grasses and other marine plants. Mar marine plants. Sea cows have an important role in the ecosystem. The constant browsing of sea grasses encourages greater growth, ensuring critical habitat and feeding sites for the, for a host of other marine species, including turtles, dolphin, and sawfish. So healthy dugong or sea cow mean here healthy seagrass and broader Great Barrier Reef health. And that's it for today. 
and I hope you learned a lot in our discussion. Thank you very much.